My name is Stacia and this is episode 7 of Torrent Freak TV. First I would like to thank Blip TV for being a great host of our videos and I would also like to thank Miro.org which was kind enough to feature our episode in their application. We're going to start the show with the news then Stacy will give you advice about Axo Torrents and at the end we will discuss some of your comments from the last episode. Mini Nova has been talked about lately because of their annual earnings report of 2006 and 2007. Ars Technica reported that Mini Nova earned 600,000 euros back in 2006 and more than 1 million in 2007. We contacted Neek, one of the founders of Mini Nova, who told us that he does not understand what all the fuzz is about and that the numbers have been public for years. He also wrote, quote, The money the company Mini Nova BV receives comes from several sources, like advertisements on Mininova.org, our website Snotter.com, Toolbar Deals, other websites and partnerships with third parties. Please note that the revenue numbers 1 million in 2007 is before taxes and expenses. We use the money to pay a 2 gigabytes per second bandwidth bill, buy and rent 30 servers, pay a team of lawyers, rent an office, hire freelancers, build new products, etc. Unquote. Is it really wrong if a torrent site is earning money? Besides, Mini Nova is a search engine for torrents. Why would it all of a sudden be wrong for search engines to make money? Do you have a comment about this? Write about it on torrentfreak.tv. And since we're talking about Mini Nova, it is also good to mention that Mini Nova is going to court in two months, where BREIN, a local anti piracy organization, is trying to convince the court that Mini Nova has to actively filter its search results and remove all unauthorized content. The big difference between this case and the Pirate Bay case is that this is a civil trial, not criminal. And while we're talking about trials, it is worth mentioning that ISO Hunt is suing CRIA looking for confirmations that the site is doing nothing illegal. Weirdly though, the trial has not received much public attention. Moving on, Apple now offers HD rentals, which will cost you a dollar more than the standard version. TV shows are still up for rent, but you can only buy them. I took a little time and calculated how much I would spend every season. If I bought all the shows on iTunes, so let's say I watch 10 different TV shows a season, even though I watch way more than that, and each show on average is 18.9 episodes a season. And of course, I'd like to watch it in HD, which costs $2.99 an episode. The total cost of all the shows would be $565.11. For this amount of money, I could have gone to the theater to watch the movie about 80 times, or I could have bought a new HD television which would look sweet in my apartment. The downloading of the TV shows will surely continue until the prices for buying them drop dramatically to like two cents. Nine Inch Nails has launched their own torrent tracker for their new tour sampler called Ninja. Nine Inch Nails has been very understanding towards the file sharing community for a while. Last year they released their album Ghost on a website for free, but the servers could not handle it. And this is why this time all of the files are also available as torrents. Head over to ninja2009.com and get your DRM free copy. Free copy, guys, so check it out. Blink is a brand new movie created by an independent film company, Anno Dan Productions. The movie has just been released on DVD, but what makes it special is that it also has been released on torrent websites. Here's a quick preview. Oh my god, you. The bad guys never win! <laughs> yeah. I never asked for this. Witnessing the murder of my family. Feeling a part of me fade away. Being adopted and raised by people I can't stand. I wouldn't be too wise. You couldn't really care less about me. Living each day with one lie after another. Being dragged through a cesspool of people that know. The cast and crew wants everybody to be able to enjoy this movie, and if you like it, buy the DVD or make them a donation. The movie is available for download from Mini Nova. 
Now it's time for Stacy to tell you something new that she has learned. Ugh. Hey guys, I've been trying to download a movie from the internet and one that was made by that guy AXO, you know? But every time I try, I end up getting a fake file, like two guys kissing or two girls in one cup for like poker software. But now I found this website called easyaxo.com where they list all the AXO releases. Oh, and I have found this new list of private trackers that are accepting new users. Check it out. I hope this helps. Mwah. Last week was my first time hosting this video podcast and reading the critiques was nothing but pure fun. I'm talking cry in my room fun. I would like to read a few of them to you and tell you what I think about them. Thank you. First was, I'm sorry, but once Stacia hit the screen and started talking, I had to stop playing it. Her acting like she was extremely pathetic, dumb blonde who was about to take her clothes off at any minute and start pleasuring herself was rather annoying, not to mention completely pointless. I want to hear about torn file sharing news. Cut the shit, please. Two thumbs down. I only hope that you guys actually read these comments for suggestions. Is that a suggestion or? Hmm, not really. Next. Wow, aren't you boring, darling? Wow, isn't this comment boring? And lastly would be, oh God, the hostess is horrible. At least find someone who can read a prompter. My God. Well, I can't really read. Check it out. In the last episode, we asked you to write the best caption for this picture. The one that we liked the best was written by Chris Mason and it says, Copyright, violator detected, target must be terminated. Thanks for that, Chris. We will send you a t-shirt right away, and I promise it won't take three months. If you would like a free Torn Freak t-shirt too, what you can do this time is write a nice email as you can about me. Yes, there was enough hating. Now I want to hear something loving. Send an email to tv at torrentfreak.com. Until next time, I will make sure I'm here. You make sure you don't get caught. Stacia, out.